Well, thanks, uh, Janil. Very nice to see all of you, and a good afternoon to everyone. Just now, we flagged off the fun quest in the neighborhood near the playground at Fitness Corner. So they are running around, trying to find their way, like an adventure race around our neighborhood here. They have 60 minutes, so we promised them that uh, if they don't come back within 60 minutes, we'll send a search party out to look for them. And we also told them that uh, to make it more exciting, we changed some of the road signs here so that they... So don't believe all the road signs. But no, no, don't worry, they will all come back in good time. But what is the purpose of all this? The purpose of all this is because we want to build a community of friends and neighbors. And not just bricks, cement and buildings. So building bricks, buildings with bricks and cement is relatively easy. You bring in a contractor, two years, three years, you put up the blocks and they are ready for you all to move in. Of course there are always one or two defects, but those can be solved. But what is more difficult always is to build a community. Some place where you know your neighbours, you feel safe, comfortable and warm. You know that when you go down in the lift, or in the car park, or you take the bus, or the LRT, or the MRT, you have friends, you recognise people, people recognise you, and you feel that this is home. And this can take more than two or three years to build up. But it has to start somewhere, and it has to start with us. So, just now, Dr. Jamil is introducing you to several of the grassroots leaders who are residents like yourself, who have stepped forward and come to help to build this community. And that is the most important thing that we can do for our community. In fact, just now, many of the people that Janil introduced were young people. But we were very happy that as we were coming in, we met one more elderly gentleman. And he had lived in Tobayo before, and he said, come, come, can I volunteer to help? And he wants to step forward to help to volunteer, because he had been an active grassroots leader in Tobayo before, and he knows what it means to build a close community. And so he wanted to know, do you all have a waterway watch here? Because he says, I'm interested, I want to help look after the Pongo waterway, make sure it is uh, clean and the water flows nicely, and that all the residents look after Pongo waterway so that we can all enjoy Pongo waterway. So he said, sure, sure. Then he volunteered more of his own expertise. He says, I have a certificate, a steersman certificate, so I can drive a boat. And if that's helpful to you, I will be happy to do so as well. So I think that is the kind of spirit that we want to see from our residents. And they step forward, they offer some expertise, experience or expertise that they have, or even if they don't have any special experience or expertise, the most important thing that they have is a heart in the right place We want to help build a community and a neighborhood for everyone who lives here. So, I think I encourage all of you, step forward, make this your goal. The PM, during his National Day Rally speech, spoke of home, of heart, and of hope. And I think this is very applicable to new communities like the one which we have here. You want to make this your home, you want to make it a home with your heart, and you want yourself, your children, to live in a place which has got hope for the future. That it's going to get better, that, you're going to, and that you are going to have a part in making it a better place for yourselves as well. And that's what we hope to do together with you here in Pongo. There are many, many new residences coming up in Pongo. And it shows that we can build good, high quality homes which are affordable for Singaporeans. And we will continue to do so in the future. So welcome once again to Pongo, the wider Pongo community. And I hope that you will do your part with all your heart to make this your home. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, DPA, let's... Uh...